Hello everyone, this is another battle from us. And by the way, due to technical difficulties, um the after it uploaded the battle it was not set to private like it was supposed to be. So whoever gave us that five star rating, thank you very much. Exactly. What what he said. Sorry, um I'm low dead. Mm -hmm. Anyway, um this was a another battle from uh, another GameFAX user. And he leads with Charizard as we lead with a Yanugus. A Yanugus. It's my Yanugus. I don't know. I want to know. What? I, I want to know why he fire spin, honestly. Fire spin isn't even a val but isn't really a valid competitive move. I was like, what the hell just happened? He's been watching our. He was watching our yellow playthrough, and he realized fire spin works like rap. Yes. Hi, Reggie. Oh, um, don't you have a little dedication you have to do? Yep, I guess so. Um, uh, I'm gonna dedicate this video to, um, Fancy, who is one of the members of the Game Packs Guild that we are both a part of. And... I promised I'd dedicate it to her, so I do. This fancy, this is this is your video, all for you. Insert random applause here. Anyway, now that we've gotten the Reggie Gigas out of the way, and, I really our, and our salutations out of the way, um, we have. For some reason, we're still alive, and I'm not sure why. We took a fire spin and an avalanche, and a half attack Reggie Gigas avalanche to the face. Yeah. So it's no surprise, really. Anyway, this guy pulls out an Arceus on us. He's breaking Uber Claws, noob. Eh. Oh well, doesn't matter too much. <laughs> to hit KO, yay! Now, if I hadn't got that flinch, I probably would have died at this point, and uh, my game plan would have tra changed drastically. Yeah, and you'd probably get be getting a better battle out of this. But <clears throat> what can you do? Uh huh. Now we're finally getting to an actual threat, quote unquote. If I if I was locked in on Bug Buzz, it probably would have done way more damage, like two hit KO. But then Charizard would have had fun with me. So I was I don't, screwed either way. You, you know that you know that critical hit psychic was completely necessary there. Yeah. But we all have to take make sacrifices. So we send Mitran, who's going to just. Obliterate. Exodia, use obliterate! Tisk, tisk. What, I have five Pokemon. Does that make Heatran the head? Yes, yes it does. Okay, then. Does it this mean we auto-win? No. No, it doesn't. Uh, sadly enough. It's Dialga! Yeah! Because, I mean, when you're using Arceus, you might as well just go ahead and throw in a random Dialga. Yep. And I get the fuck it, pretty much. And I take an Earth Power to the face. And watch how much damage it does. I love this. You know, my question is, how is Earth Power really a, you know, ground move? Because when you look at it, it looks like a freaking volcano erupting. I know, right? Stealth Rock. Yay. Set that up. We need it. Probably don't. Roar of Time. Lovely. In before it fails to kill you. Oh, just watch. And you live at 1. I was half right. You lived at 51. No, you were 50 off, actually. I was half right because I got one of the digits right. Okay. I'll grant you that one. And I thought I'd set up, set up Toxic Spice thinking his last Pokemon was going to be Palkia. I, I see some sort of, like, theme running here. I don't know. So I thought, so I'd stop Palkia from being a dick if it was there. That's what I was thinking at this point. But we don't know. And we have a scissor. Do, 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 do. I take an overheat to the fa Oh. Take an overheat to the face, yes. I take an overheat to the face and live. No. 
I take an aura sphere to the place. You live, you, live that, you live that overheat quite nicely, I must add. I know. <laughs> it's like, surprising to me. These, it's like, I don't know what these people are talking about. It says they're being weak to fire. It's got no weakness. No weak sizzle. Exactly. Send an intran. Since I could overheat. safely come in because I'd already been hit. So I decided overheat. to overheat. This is where an actual overheat looks like. Yes. Not, not some poser overheat that looks like Aura Sphere. And he lives, but... I'm not going to let you live that down, by the way. What? The overheat incident. Yes. Is that what we're going to call it? The overheat incident? We're going to call it the new incident. But, um... Can't we call it the Chuck Norris incident? No, because it wasn't awesome. Aw, you are T-Tran. It was a good sacrifice, though, because he is now within KOing range of this thing. Da, 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 da. He just, like, uppercuts him to the face. Scissor just, like, jumps and uppercuts Dialga in the face. Mm hmm. And Lugia. And if this you... makes you cry. Game Freak actually predicted what moves they were going to put on um Sizzle. Already had it in, already had it in mind. Because in the Crystal Sprite, the animation, Sizzle looks like he's using Bullet Punch. That's true. And Arrow Blast. And before the, that's actually a very cool animation. Mhm. Mm so I took an Arrow Blast, and an Aura right. Sphere to the face. And, and you're like, you're like at a fourth. Roughly. Yeah, roughly. I know I'm not at the third. Well, no. Yeah, I'm about a third, actually. Meh. We'll call it 28% and leave it at that. Okay. Fair enough. 